Big shout out to Armando. You are the winner of the giveaway. You yourself win some still in Gen 2 intakes. And we're gonna have to figure out the delivery method or shipping method or whatever the case may be. But congratulations and thank you for entering. Let's begin the video. with another video nor gang so today i'm gonna do something a little bit in a different format here's monica here's nor.tm if you don't know my instagram is nor.tm well at nor.tm but you get what i mean so today i'm gonna do something a little bit different in a different kind of format i guess more of like a sit and chill a little park and chill you know a little crookedness and yeah we're just gonna talk about something that happened that just warms my little heart <laughs> Get in there, man. You're already standing there like a creep. You might as well. Jeez. Yeah. Right. <laughs> but look how cinematic we look, though. Look at that background. Sorry, right, so I just wanted to start by saying thank you to everybody who came out to the meet that was on Thursday. It was actually a huge success, mainly towards uh, a lot of you guys who are local to me in Miami and Homestead and Hialeah. A lot of you guys came far, JP from um, Boca Raton. And also, big, huge shout out to Yaz from the Z Couple because, what, it was like 20 Zs? Like, you just... Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> it, there had to be like at least 20 Z's in total that were there that day. I don't know, maybe I'm overshooting me or not, but it was it was really sick. So thank you guys for all coming out. And it was just really fun. Like, a lot of good vibes. Thank you to my boy Brandon Perkins for showing up. Thank you for me for just showing up. And thank you for Mari TV for just showing up. While we were at the meet, you know, we there is some of the people that have been following my channel for a little while now, and it's been almost a year. There's a good rivalry between Short Guy Productions and myself. The first time we ever, <laughs> the first time I ever raced JP, it was uh, actually on my daughter's birthday, and I'm sure if you really look down, you'll see the it's the automatic versus the manual video. Uh, it was a lot of fun, you know. We <laughs> we lined it up. I was I think almost completely stock, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I was completely stuck. I didn't even have intakes, exhaust, nothing. Driver mod. <laughs> yes, yeah, it's just driver mod. My footage got corrupt, so I had to redo it. But now, uh, we were talking about the mods, what I had for JP at that time. He had test pipes, intakes, and actually the ones that I gave away. And, um,. What else? Oh, and muffler delete, but I don't know. That, that, like, again, back, even back in, I said in that video, there's a whole debate if that's the legitimate or not. Like, if it makes you lose power, yeah, whatever, whatever. The first race that we had, it was pretty funny because I had absolutely nothing and I was able to take the W. But it was funny because since it was a short distance, I'm pretty sure I only won just because we never even got to the top end. This, then the next time was at Fast Lane Fridays and that was just an embarrassment. Now, JP, let me explain something. It's a little dick. Why? Because he was flexing on me so hard. He got so mad and I'm, I'm gonna put you on blast. He got so mad that he got beat by a stock Z that he, you know, he put some money into his car and he came back for me he went for the kill and uh, you know honestly that it's good competition so i'm with it he wanted to race again i'm always super down to race well you know was but i'll get into that in a different video we went at it so he won now where the difference is is that when i beat him especially with a stocksy i didn't flex i don't flex at all if i take a win i take a win i don't talk crap i leave it at that the next day's a new day whatever this guy bro nor game this is when we go in kill mode okay jp decided to go ahead and flex and i'm mind you stock z versus tune z uh <laughs> like what bro like you crazy of course of course you're gonna destroy me man like i have almost nothing all i had at that time was just uh the intakes that were on his car and that actually gave that are in the giveaway now and isr catback exhaust bro i'm not gonna have gains like that come on bro so you know he got all happy like oh yeah i beat ray well how did that go this time for the third rematch it was a lot more serious this time i was like you know what i'm not letting this guy getting i'm not gonna let him get the better hand of me or whatever stupid saying you can say i'm not letting it happen twice in a row how did it go jp huh how did it go 
well, I'll tell them, okay? Because your boy took the W. And I'm gonna show why. Now, also disclaimer, it was a super close race. There was no, by no means did, oh, well, actually, you know, before I even show it, let's talk about what this little jerk said. This guy was like, oh, when we're tuning with Martin, and Martin asked if he ran anybody because he had like little issues with his couplers on his intake. Hey, JP, have you run anybody with this car? Oh, yeah, I ran Ray, and I destroyed him. I'll put the clip here, bro. I don't, I don't want to be all talk. I want you guys to see it. Did the car feel okay to you? Or yeah. Really? I don't know. I... You've been in a lot of Z's or not so many? No, this is my first Z. You ever, you ever run anybody with this thing? Like... Yeah. I mean, with the, yeah, I, I had somebody beat me, and then I when I tuned it, I destroyed him. I destroyed him. Oh. I mean, sorry. Sorry, Ray. I know you're going to watch <laughs> this video. This guy destroyed me? Bruh, you gonna flex on me with a tune? Come on, bro. So, I came back after we tuned. I waited and waited and waited and waited and waited and waited. And it finally happened, so... After finally pressuring this guy for a little while, we finally got to racing. And again, this, this is the part where I'm saying disclaimer. The drivers of my car and JP's car, they were incredibly close. That race was no, by no means a gapping. Driver of my car, I'm gonna say I was very happy with their performance. There was a moment where they, one moment where they short shifted. I think it was out of panic because when they saw the, the driver in JP's car starting to, to pull away, it was like, a, oh crap, just trying to get more power or whatever. Might have worked, might not have, I don't know. Dude, JP. Dog, JP. <laughs> Man, let me tell you something. Don't ever say you destroyed me again. There's, It's never going to happen again, bro. Uh, after the race, well, you know what? Let's post the race. Let's post the race. you guys to see this race why because it's so incredible nor gang it's nothing's better than having some person talk crap and it just gets shoved right back in their face all right and that's exactly what happened and i'm glad it happened that way because you never flex there's one thing you never do and it's flex because you never know what's gonna happen you never know what that person is gonna do you never know what they're gonna slap in the car it's just there's too many variables and to me it's just it's just a bad look now don't get me wrong i'm still super cool with jp hopefully he's still super cool with me but i would be bummed because monica only has four mods bro and it's mostly just it, it's it, it's exhaust and intakes that's it i just have exhaust intakes in tune jp is literally full bolt-on oh well, no he's missing headers so uh, he's almost full bolt-ons and to me that's bananas bro like uh, i don't <laughs> i'm just so happy because dude it's just again nothing's better than taking a w but it was a very close cheap w wins a win i'm not really gonna flex on it because to me that's not the type of race i'm gonna be like oh for sure like i don't know i don't know that's not gonna be the type of race i'm gonna be like oh you're slow because it was a good race actually it was a very good race those drivers did very well those cars to me performed very well like our cars performed very well so i was i was just happy to see it but the driver of my car only took the w by bro fender or or bumper it looks really close if they were to keep going then jp's car would have for sure taken my car and the driver would have to probably pop fifth and and in fifth gear it's no longer a friendly race that's a competition so who knows how that would have came out but we're not gonna find out until another time so we'll we'll go to the track well this time it'll be JP and myself driving at PBIR or Homestead wherever you want to take it we're gonna we're gonna take this again we're both retuning in June June you know so we'll see what happens but again I just want to play the video one more time let's play the video one more time for you guys Let's play the video in reverse. Let's play the video with explosions. Can't do the explosions, but you get what I mean. Whatever, I'm just glad to rub it in his face in just this video, and it's the only time I'm gonna do it, and I'm gonna leave it be. But thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for being supportive. We're at 570 subscribers, almost to 600. It's just been a wild ride. Thank you guys so much. If you like the video, just make sure you actually hit that like button. It helps the channel grow a lot. Trust me, that's the only reason why we're even gaining subs. 
just please uh, help your boy out. Share the video, you know? Share it one time, just one time. Show, show a friend, you know? Like, hey, guys, this guy, he's he's really cool. He wears beanies when it's 93 degrees outside. Come on, man, help me out. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.